Buyers don't just love what's going on inside the house, they look for value in the garden as well. Veggie patches add interest and colour to a garden and are a big hit with buyers. It's been so cold in Adelaide making it hard to get out into the garden. But winter's almost over and with spring comes a chance to plant some veggies. Hi, I'm Mari McWilliam, an Adelaide real estate agent with Harcourt's Williams Property and in these videos I look at all things real estate. Here are some tips to choose which veggies to plant in your, in your home's veggie patch and how to ensure they'll thrive. Carrots are easy to grow from seeds and are great fun to pull from the garden when they're ready to harvest. Carrots like soft soil and are ready to pick as baby carrots around 10 weeks, otherwise they can stay in the garden and be picked as you need them. Lettuce is also easy to grow and can be harvested as you need it. Lettuce grows best in partially shaded spots and likes moist soil as they have shallow roots so frequent watering is necessary. Mulching the, so the soil is a good idea and to keep the snails at bay, coffee grinds and beer traps are effective deterrents. Pumpkins are also a favourite and need sun, space and compost to do well. Grow them away from other veggies so they can spread out and they take between 70 to 120 days to ripen and can be stored for months in a cool dark space. Radishes are quick and easy to grow and are a yummy peppery addition to a salad. They don't need much space and are ready to pick in four to eight weeks. Sow seeds six millimetres deep in rows you may, and you may need to thin out the plants if they look as though they're too overcrowded. Now like carrots, radishes are such a pleasure to pull from the ground. Zucchini seeds take sort of six to ten days to germinate and then grow really quickly and are ready to pick in six to eight weeks. And pick the small ones, they've got the best flavour. Now for more detailed information on growing veggies, ask your local garden centre or check out the Gardening Australia website. Good luck with your spring planting and send me some photos of your harvest.